And so that makes it fun, I think, for both of us to uncover where the sustainability might be if it's not immediately evident, because it's not always immediately obvious, but it's always there somewhere. Everything touches on some sustainability angle, whether social, economic, or environmental. So we get to find it, we get to figure out whether we build it into, you know, a project or an assignment or a test or, or even just a lesson plan, wherever it fits best. These are complex challenges. Um, that um, sustainability is a complex challenge. There's not explicitly one right answer. There's a host of human factors. There's a host of environmental factors. There's a host of technological factors that, that are taken into account when you're analyzing and synthesizing a, uh, an issue related to uh, education for sustainability. But also, the other thing that I found is really successful is if you celebrate other people who are doing the same thing. So we have case writers within the faculty, uh, and when we find out that they've done a sustainability case, then we like to showcase it and let everybody know about it, um, because there's that mutual respect that, um, and and often um, a bit of, again, influence. You know, a senior professor produces a sustainability case. Other people are more likely to use that than, you know, just one that shows up on the Harvard catalog or whatever.